In this video, uh, we're going to learn how to use uh, image uh, sprites. So first of all, how do we define uh, image sprites? Uh, basically, uh, many websites uh, like um, Apple, they will avoid loading many uh, pictures at a time. And rather than doing that, they will use one uh, master image and they will use CSS positions to uh, display images that are uh, only chunks of that uh, big image. So for instance, if we now display this bit of the image, we just need to use the CSS position of the image and the dimensions of the image. Other websites like Amazon are using the same way of doing, utilizing uh, image sprites, which makes the overall user experience more uh, smooth and it avoids all the multiple HTTP requests and all the uh, flickering of pictures. So let's um, build our, our own example. So what we're trying to achieve here, so we're trying to uh, use this picture. So we want to be able to uh, display only one chunk of the picture using some coordinates and the dimensions of the picture to uh, display. So let's create a an image first in the body. And let's give you an ID, image one. And let's style it. We're gonna go image one. So, so we want the width to be hundred pixels and the height to be hundred pixels as well. And we want to set the background uh, using the uh, in the picture okay and now we need to tell the browser well what are the coordinates of the position we're starting from so what's going on here is that we're starting from zero zero and we are displaying a picture with dimensions 100 pixels by 100 pixels which is this this bit so so that's that, that point has got coordinates zero zero. If we uh, move to another point here, the uh, coordinates to use are not the ones shown on the uh, screen now, which are 310 and 304, but we need to use minus 310 and minus 304 because we are uh, looking at our position uh, relative to uh, this, this point. And basically zero zero is equivalent to the dimensions of the picture. So uh, a coordinates of zero, zero is the same as coordinate coordinates of 2,248, 1,500. And we can prove that if we change this zero, zero to the dimensions of the picture, then we get exactly the same result. Okay, so now let's um, go for another example. Let's try to show the chunk starting there and ending there. So the starting point we need now is going to be minus 700, minus 200. And the width, we're going to go for 500 by 500, for instance. Yeah, and we're, we're seeing exactly what we wanted. So we wanted that, that bit, and that's what we are seeing here. So that's how uh, image uh, sprites uh, work. 
it is a powerful tool and uh, it's something to keep in mind when we're doing web design and also they allow a better way of maintaining website design as well.